Hi guys, thanks for checking the video out. Steve Buzzer here. So I've made it to Greenbrier and it's the final stop on my mega trip with Megan Golfro. So Megan is on the camera and we have had the greatest trip. So to finish it off, we're on the Old White TPC which holds a PGA Tour event. An event in 2010 in which Stuart Appleby shot a 59. So what we're going to do is we're going to join teams, me and Megan. Mega Buzz would be, would that be our? Yeah, Mega Buzz, I like it. Mega Buzz. So we've joined forces and we're going to see if we can replicate the back nine. His front nine, he started with a four. I started with a four. Woo! He then had eight threes in a row. <laughs> I did not. So epic road trip finishes trying to recreate something that was truly epic. So let's get on to the principles now. What club do you have? So I have 21. I, I think the hole is called principles nose because there is a bunker right in the middle. You'll see we're playing off their back tees. They do have a championship tee. So that's the one thing that's in my favor and your favor compared to uh, what, uh, what he did in that PGA Tour event but he shot five under on this back nine. I think it was five, so Megan, if you're gonna make some birdies, <laughs> this is the time. This is your moment to shine. You up for it? I'm in. In the fairway. It's a good way to start. Let's make birdies. So Team Megabuzz have decided that we've had a little team talk and Megan's going right to the front tees. Gives her the best chance of making birdies. It almost can end up playing a bit too short for her, so she does find on a lot of courses going a little further back is, is better. Birdies. But we're here to make birdies. Alright, she's going to grip it and rip it. That's the spirit. A little left, it should path. be down there. Oh, little cart path. Using the cart oh. path, using the forward tees, oh, Megan is fully <laughs> engaged into this challenge. Let's do this. 126 to the flag, so I'm, wind down off the right. I'm going that and wedge. And if I wanted to make birdies, I've got Megan who does the aim point. I've got Connor, how long have you worked here? Co Corey. 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 Nine years, so you know the greens. <laughs> so in theory, I've just got to get it there, and you two will do the rest. <laughs> oh, I pushed it. Uh oh. Not the best of shots. On the green. Sounded like it was on the green. Maybe a little short. short. A little short. Not birdie range. <laughs> Up to you, Megan. Hey, you can chip in. 90 yards right up over the track. So the oh, rough. The gap wedge yeah, there. I think you've just got to give it a whack. The rough is really thick here yeah, at the minute. Grass is very thick. And from where we've come from, it's a very different style of grass. So I'm not really going to be able to stop this. So no. I'm just going to. It runs yeah. away from you, so. Big thumper. Good contact, stay in the air. Oh, very good, Megan. And the birdie. On the green. Very good. <laughs> so it looks like Steve has about 60 to 65 feet. It's been interesting today getting used to different kind of grass. It's they are in perfect shape, but just a um, not as fast as some of the other ones that we played this week because of the different style of grass. They are in great shape and he gave it a run for it, but just that good for par. Up, that matched, Stuart. 
That that matched Applebee's first hole, or tenth hole, right? Uh, it did. So but. I have. But Team Mega Buzz has a chance to beat him. Yeah, let's do it. Get that. worn up on our competition. Yeah. So you played a nice shot from the rough, so you had no ability to stop it. So it has rolled over this little mound. Downhill. Yeah, I think there's a foot, two foots worth. Maybe in the three gradient. So I think she concurs. Greens, I think she may have just said a bit slower than what we played previously. Just because it's a different style of grass. A bit more moisture here. But they're true as anything, so if we can get the lines, we can make some birdies. She's got the line just a bit short. It's a par, and on to the next. Four hundred and forty-eight yards from this tee box. I say, he didn't birdie this one, but I kind of see why. <laughs> Bit of a brute. Yeah. Going over these tracks on the on the left. Kind of into off the left, isn't it? Yeah, it does feel like it is. Pretty strong wind today. So it appears that Steve is going to cut the corner there. And I think he perfectly placed himself for his second shot. Really like that. Really good. Well done. So up to Megan. Can you see more of the fairway here? Same line as mine? Yeah. I like that big tall tree yeah, up there. Yeah, me too. What a glorious tree. Knock it in it. I love that tree. I love hitting it to the way left. <laughs> You know, I had a really bad feeling. That's why, you know, usually when you see those extra practice swings, just had a really bad feeling about that. Well, Mental self-talk wasn't very good on that no. one. Your but. feeling was right, though. So hopefully when you get a good feeling, you'll hit good shots. Usually when you see you take like five or six practice swings, it's not a good sign. Oh, no. Uh, Let's get up there and see. <laughs> sure, it didn't, didn't birdie this one, Megan. See, don't worry about it. <laughs> So what was the yardage? Not that I'm not listening. 210. 210. Um, I, so, the, I the rough is really thick. Yeah, I should be hitting a hybrid out of here, but since, you know, we're going for birdie. We're going for birdie, and you look where I am, so. Okay. Right hand corner. I think if it doesn't come out, it should chase up the fairway anyway. So yeah. Well, Aggression, is, this is what it's all about. Oh, you got it up and out. You have to dig at it. Bunker or over it? Yeah, I have a feeling this is going to be all you on this whole team. <laughs> I thrive at the pressure though, it's good thinking. <laughs> That's why you're the team captain. <laughs> 135 here. Is that pin right in the middle? Right in the middle. Ooh, nice low ball flight. I like it. Beautiful. I do like that. Really nice. Very nice indeed. I'll get you out of jail, Megan. Thank you. Good Call job, me the partner. Monopoly man. So Megan has got. That's okay, no problem at all. 57. Uh, horrible break. It's a lot easier if it's in the bunker, isn't it? Oh yeah, I really wish it was in here for sure. I'm up close though, so you can just uh, hit and hope. Yep. Pocket it if it doesn't work. <laughs> Good effort. Alright Steve, you're the one going for this one. <laughs> Jeez. So Megan, with the 
hybrid, the trusty hybrid. This is just to ease a little pressure off me. Very much a freebie. Can have a roll at it. Yeah. So easy to do that when you're trying to hold it. So Steve's going for the birdie here. Medium breaking putt. And oh, he did birdie. We're ahead. Seal of approval from these guys over here. <laughs> the gallery. We're ahead of him. If, yes. if anything, go, it can all go wrong from here. We're ahead of the game. 